This is the British Broadcasting Corporation. This is the voice of the Mr. Arms. We know that you can hear us, Earth Men. I lived my childhood in scrambled monochrome. Before internet wonders and the advent of the mobile phone, my screen was 14 inches by 10. Untouchable, no swiping back then. The TV lived on a shelf in the corner, black and white with a rotary tuner. You could get all the channels, BBC and ITV, and if you were lucky, the test card made three. That little girl in dark dress and matching hairband, playing noughts and crosses with chalk in her hand, a stuffed opponent with wild staring eyes, a fixed grin and an expression of tortured surprise. I'm amazed more people don't have the same dream of those two creatures crawling out from that screen and shedding their static and painful photons and turning into misanthropic misterons. This is the voice of the scary-eyed stuffed toy. At first, I binged on a diet of bagpuss and Mr. Ben's wardrobe. That was before Teletubbies melted a generation's frontal lobes. But Mr. Ben was arrested for historic child abuse and bagpuss went feral after hitting the booze. So on to Marine Boy, my first taste of Japanese anime. His oxygum could have been useful to the crew of Stingray. That relationship wasn't entirely platonic. Here's me, an eight-year-old boy, sexually aroused by a puppet. And then there was Joe 90 with his glasses from the NHS, more Milky Bar Kid than Spy in his psychedelic vortex. And Fireball XL5, commanded by Colonel Steve Zodiac. Low budget special effects, I'm still getting the flashbacks. Now some say that Thunderbirds was the pinnacle of Super Mario Nation. All them rocket ships and that fella stranded alone up in that space station. But I'm not so sure that the Tracy family were the apogee. I mean, just look at the pile of shite that was Thunderbird 3. And then one day, a mild epiphany while I was fiddling with the tuning. Captain Scarlet! Now watching that in Hughes of Grey was quite confusing. Scarlet and Captain Black were easy, but Magenta, Ochre and Green, they were hard to follow on a fuzzy 14 by 10 inch screen. He was indestructible, even in black and white. Him and his angels of the sky always ready to take flight. And if I remember correctly, they were melody, destiny, symphony and harmony. And once again, I have to confess, I had a crush on Rhapsody. Captain Scarlet fought the good fight, commanded by Colonel White. And you'd know the Mysterons from the moving circles of light. This is the voice of the Mr. Arms. We know that you can hear us, Earthmen. Aye, idle threats they were, thwarted and outwitted again and again. <laughs> Sitting behind the sofa, I'd lurch and convulse as Captain Scarlet did battle and the Mr. Arms were repulsed. And then when it was all over and Captain Black was defeated, I'd sit back down again all cathartic and exhausted. But my child's mind's meanderings were soon distracted by Blue Peter's patronising middle-class didactic. And then the afternoon's entertainment came to its climax. A new paradigm of stellar stuffed toy parallax. A new set of mannequins extraplanetary, whistling voices piping existential commentary. The garbling soup dragon in dialectical discussion with warbling clangers and a geostationary iron chicken.
But that was then, and this is now, and I am much older. Though my memories remain, they're increasingly bipolar. Captain Scarlet's on YouTube in high definition, and the Clangers are masters of linguistic erudition. But you can see the strings now and the slipshod animation, and gone is the wonder of Jerry Anderson's rolling credits anticipation. I lived my childhood in static-infused shades of grey, loitering under 1970s spider plant macrame. The TV on the shelf glittered in white and black, and life in colour suffers from a paucity, a lack of those magical mysterons and the indestructible Captain Scarlet. And now the skies of my young imagination are starless. I lived my childhood in monochrome. I've lived my life in monochrome. My life in monochrome. 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 monochrome.